Gabriel from Dry Trade. Uh, we're going to show you how to clean a surface like this. Uh, everybody has something like this in their in their home, uh, a wall or a, a patio of some sort that's ex been exposed uh, during winter and uh, got pretty grimy and full of mold. And we're going to show you how to, in a quite a short space of time, make that look like new again. Now this little wall has a little bit of everything. Over here we've got some black mold growing, quite a, quite a bit of grime as well. And uh, further up here on top, we've got some mold spores, all these little light green spots here. And then further along this wall, over here, you can see we've got quite a nice sample of green mold uh, growing on the wall. So we've got a little bit of everything here, um, quite, a, quite a messy area to clean up. Uh, this is the product we're going to be using to clean the surface. Uh, it's called OxyCleanser. Uh, the great thing about this product is one small bottle like this, which is quite inexpensive, will cover a very large area. It will clean about a thousand square feet or a hundred square meters for those who use the metric system. Um, and now I'm talking about a surface that's heavily soiled and full of mold, um, maybe that's been through a few winters. So you're going to find this uh, quite, quite cheap to use and quite effective. The product's very easy to use. You just pop a scoop of it into some hot water or warm water. It's in this case, we're using a watering can. Just mix it around a little. You can quite easily use a bucket or a sprayer of some sort. Um, just stir it around, make sure it's all mixed in, and then we can apply it to the surface. Once your product's nicely mixed, then you need to apply a generous saturation coat to the surface. Uh, you can use a watering can for this, like we're doing here, or you can use something like a low pressure spray or a brush, or a mop, or anything really, to get plenty of the product on the surface. Once you've applied plenty of product to the surface, then it's important to let it sit there for at least 10 to 15 minutes. Once you've left the product on the surface for long enough, then you can give it a good scrub, with a hand scrubbing brush, or a deck scrubber, or something like that, and then rinse it off with a hose. Or you can use a pressure washer if you have one.